Expo. There's all kinds of cool stuff going on. Mostly I spend my time hanging out in Artist Alley, but we're also going to play some games and meet some things and possibly talk about some economic critical theory um, while waiting in a line. It's going to be fun. I am here with Amy Williams, who just sold me this amazing postmodernist piece. I love it. I have wandered all over this con looking for it. Um, so Amy, can you tell me a little bit about your work? Um, well, it's Perler Beats. It's actually um, originally a kid's craft, and it still is. I used to do them when I was a kid, um, and it was like really simple designs, jumbled colors and such. Uh, and then I saw, oh, <laughs> I saw a couple years ago, um, someone had made a little Mario, and I, I was like, wow, these are still around, and then I just kind of jumped headfirst into the whole thing. <laughs> nice. Do you have a website where I can check out more of your work, or? Uh, well, it, I don't have anything on my Etsy because I'm a little bit lazy. But uh, I'm fairly easy to reach um, on my Facebook, which is uh, facebook.com slash Cheshire Grin Art. And it's Cheshire G-R-Y-N-N-E Art. So it's, it's spelled a bit different. <laughs> Thanks a lot. Thank you so much for your painting and for your time. I am here. I'm buying a, a sweet print. Can you hold that up, Marco? Yep. Yeah. Awesome. What, what kind of stuff do you draw? Uh, this is all whimsical stuff that comes out of my head. I love two things. I love horror movies, which explains these three. I also love childhood art, you know, character-based kind of, you know, just things that remind me of my own childhood, which explains these two. I also have some other prints that aren't here anymore, thankfully. And um, this book is kind of sort of whimsical landscapes. Uh, I paint a lot from life. I capture a lot of, you know, light and the character of light is what I love to do. That's why I'm a painter. And uh, that's kind of what I'm inspired by. So there you go. You have a website? I have a website, which is uh, www.marcobucci, that's M-A-R-C-O-B-U-C-C-I dot com. Awesome. Thanks so much, man. Thank you. All right. I am buying more stuff. I'm here with Megan Jessup, who is super cool. She's signing my artwork at the moment, but we will re reveal what it is in time. So yeah, take your time. It's cool. It's not like we're filming or anything. I'm oh, sorry. <laughs> this is all staying in. I'm not. Uh, I'm not cutting uh, any of it. Oh my gosh. Okay. Signing. 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 Autofocus. Come on, autofocus. No, no. All right. Give her. Hold her up. They're all. Naked dwarf pinups. Yeah, that's totally gonna sit in the background. Do you always draw naked dwarves, Megan? Sometimes. Sometimes. So not always then. No. no, you want to talk about your work a bit? Yeah, sure. Yeah. Freelance artist. I draw a lot of shipping and pinup and well, okay, yeah, yeah. comics. None of the comics are in here though. A lot of fan art. A lot of original stuff. Awesome. You got a website? Yes. It is Megan I Jessup at or dot blogspot.com. Ooh, I will all it will also be in the show notes. This will be my fan expo video, which is going up on Tuesday. Hey! So that's Megan, who is awesome. You should definitely check out her work. Cause I'd love you even if we were being chased by a horde of zombies. I'd never leave.